Just when y'all thought it was all over, huh? Y'all thought y'all was going to get this win over me? I remember what happened last game. I ain't no sucker. Y'all not going to beat me again. If I got anything to do with it right now, I guarantee y'all won't get this W. I ain't playing. Now I got that goal completed. Oh, hold on. I'm real close to that A+. Plus. Oh, sh oh, cookies. Oh, y'all was so close. Oh, but I got the A+. Plus. Wow, that's my first A+. Plus, but y'all sub me out when I get an A+, plus, though. Is that what we doing, 2K? Listen, 2K, if you do not make me win. Oh, all right. Man, Minnesota thought they could just come in and get this W. I wasn't going for it. Not at all. Man, I had to be player of the game. It was the only way I was going to win. I had to outshine my own team. Hey, almost had 50 points. I know I didn't get 10 assists. I know I didn't reach my goal. But coming out with the W is a whole lot better than anything else. And Damian Lillard, oh, I can't stand this guy, man. He still got the starting spot. I'm still on the bench after gaining the starting spot. I'm all types of pissed off. But I looked at the schedule. We got New York up next. You already know what that means, right? Mellow City, man. I'm about to go to New York, see what's going on with Mellow. Let's jump into it. Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's iPod King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. I want to welcome you guys to my New Year's game. Yeah, that's how far I am into my season. I'm trying to catch up, man. It's real hard trying to put out all these videos and try to catch up to where I am in my career, man. I'm past All-Star Weekend. No, I'm not going to tell y'all if I got hit by the glitch or not. Y'all going to have to find out about that later when it comes up. But so far, I'm still not in the starting lineup. No, I, I haven't got my starting spot back yet, man. But I still got my pregame intros. I can still pull those off with class, right? <laughs> But it's all good, man. I'm about to hit this back, flip off this uh, announcer's table with a track suit on. But it's all good. At least I ain't tripping fall, right? But getting into the first play as soon as I'm getting in the game, you already know I'm going straight to the rack, man. I'm trying to force everything I can to get into the paint. i just been actually trying out certain things with the game, you know. You already know that my pick and rolls work to somewhat perfection, but... I have to start hitting guys that cut to the basket when I'm not looking. Now, with that pass, that was just some cheese right there. Computer on computer. Hey, I can't call it as long as it was my teammate making a shot. But I've been noticing, man, every time I call a pick and roll play, other players cut. And I need to start noticing that more. I know I talk all this nonsense about Dom City this and Dom City that. But as being a facilitator, I need to step my game up. That's all I'm saying. But you see me trying to put this boy on skates right now. I'm waiting for somebody to cut to the basket. My boy Leonard right there, he cuts to the basket, and I get the easy assist. That's how we're going to be doing it every game until I get my starting spot back. I'm going to try to put more assists on the board than anything. But at the same time, I'm not taking a loss. So if I need to score, I'm going to do what I need to do like I did right there. I'm going in for layups. I can I can break ankles all game long. Like you guys seen a little bit of my black top footage, man. I put a show on when I got the ball in my hand. That's how it is. But um, I would never cut to the basket for an alley oop. <laughs> that's that's one thing I won't do. I'm only six one. Uh, but check out this shot right here. As soon as I caught the ball, landed on my feet. I didn't even give the defender time to get set in the defensive position. I'm pulling up like it ain't nothing. Real rap. And you already know, man. The jump shots is cash when I'm putting them up. Um, sometimes a lot of people say, "Hey, man, why don't you post miss and things like that?" You want to know the funny thing about editing? Some people edit a certain way. Some people only edit when the score changes for their my player. Like right there. When I seen myself make that three-point shot when Stoudemire rolled and went away from me, guess what I did? I hit the cut button. I took that clip and I made sure that that thing was perfect though before I put it on. But um, it's, a, it's a lot of things you guys need to know about this my player or my career mode, whatever you want to call it. These three-point shots. Ugh. Brought to you by Sprint. Happy New Year's, everybody. This is 2K Sports, making sure that your entire calendar gets off to a good start. The Trailblazers have been rolling along. Right now, they sit with the second-best record in the conference. The captain dominating the first two quarters. He's got 17 points and is also sharing the ball, picking up assists as well. And for New York's angle, they've been grinding away. 
High speed, high energy. Every time they get the ball, they're off and running. And that'll do it for us here in the studio. Thanks for watching. Enjoy the rest of the game. Welcome back. The calendar has flipped over, and so have we into the second half of our... Okay, back to regular scheduled programming. Um, but for the halftime report cut me off, I wanted to tell you guys that if you don't got your three-point shot up by now, something is wrong with you because it's the cheesiest thing in this game. Um, it's nothing cheesier, trust me. Check out the shooting here. Look where the defender jumped from. He jumped from the foul line. Look at this play. Why was he not on me when I came off the screen? That that right there is selfish cheese. The the way they sag off is unbearable. But me myself, I love it. Hey Ronnie, do not patch it until I get to 99, please. Thanks a lot. <laughs> but I'm just trying to do my thing right now. You see, look all all this sagging space he's giving me. So why not pull it? <laughs> why not pull it? Even though I got the shooter's roll, it's definitely cash. We going down the other side of the floor. They're down, and that's what I like to see. <laughs> But on these offensive plays, when Lillard start getting out of pocket, sometimes I just need to get away from that man because he's on his own mission. Like, check this out. Why would you force it so much knowing darn well you're not going to get to the rack, you're not going to score, and now the heat is on me. So guess what I do? I go in. I get fouled for and one. I'm going to the line. The crowd is pissed. You, you seen the guy in the crowd like, hey, man, this is crazy. Why is he dominating my team like this? That's because can't nobody on these squads stick me. I'm way too fast, man. Just when y'all thought athletic point guards were the worst position and style to make, they're actually the best. Because remember, you're already fast. So once you become a shooter and you're impeccably fast, oh my goodness, the game just opens wide. But I can't call it. But check out this play that I'm about to pull off right now. Instead of me taking an open shot, I actually want to get an assist. So I'm going to wait for Jeffries to cut in the paint and let him do his thing and get my assist. That's what we do. You see me trying to hype up the crowd. What I need to start doing is when I'm playing the game, I need to leave the analogs alone during like dead spots in the game to actually see a little bit of celebration from my player. But you see me, we up three right now with six seconds to go. It's time for me to put the nail in the coffin. And with that shooter's roll, I actually put in one nail. I need about five more nails, man. This is not a comfortable lead, even though I'm up four. Because check that out, a full court pass to Tyson and Chandler, and he makes it. Like, this type of stuff is crazy in 2K. But they're sending the king back to the line. It's time for me to seal the deal, put more nails in the coffin, beat a dead dog. Like, straight up. Like, New York is not coming back. I'm not letting it happen. And the funny thing is, as I was playing this game, right, I was like, oh, why don't I miss one and make one and see if they can hit a three by me calling the timeout to send it in overtime. And then I was like, hold on, hold on, wait. I need to get all the wins that I can right now because as I'm just an up and coming player on my career, you really get sagged off a lot. But as you become a star and become more of an icon, you get more fan support and all of that, the computer turns into a supercomputer. They're guarding you constantly. They don't let you out their sight. They don't sag off. They're always in your chest. And even though I'm very far in my career and I'm telling you things that I've seen from, you know, experience, I just want to say that I really like the game. I'm just waiting for the patches, man. That's all. That's all I'm doing. But this is IKC signing out. I'm going to see y'all at the press conference. I'm going to let Jive Turkey take it out. Pan out, so they drafted iPod. David caught a perfect picture like a tripod. A point guard that delivers like Papa John's. Me drafted as the front page topic. I'm Philly's pride, Team Villanova. 
finesse game but the heart of a soldier When I go to the rack, there's no stopping me Better bring a double team, better stand properly <laughs> On defense, move your feet Taking the blades to the chip to abuse the heat I was raised like a crip cause I ruled the street Not the court, the blacktop, the moves, the heat Pull off, it's like the late, great, great Magic Johnson I got drafted 11, that was nonsense Name a player that penetrates better Number 15 on the Polo Sports sweater Chris Paul better pass the torch fast I'm the weatherman on the court, the forecast Said it's gon' rain, I'ma bring pain Double team Dave Carter bet I go lame I'm the king, LeBron better step off He kicked the door down, I'll blow the deck off no rookie in this league can get with me. Most points, most assists, better make history. 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 You had 33 points tonight. It seemed pretty clear that you tried to step it up offensively. Is there anything in particular you could point to that led to this performance? Well, actually, a few weeks back, um, after talking to Coach and to the GM, I realized that my minutes had got depleted and I went back to the bench. Um, I, to tell you the truth, I don't even suit up nowadays, man. I just come in whenever the coach tells me. And I feel like I need to show Coach that I'm the star player. I'm the point guard he wants and needs. So from here on out, I'm going to put up amazing numbers. I'm not going down without a fight. Hey, Damien, I see you over there. I just want to let you know, man. It's going to be a long journey, man. I'm telling you, I'm going to put you behind on the bench. You're going to be picking up them Gatorade towels, all of that. You know what I'm saying? And then to, and to Coach, I see you over there with your big behind head, man. Uh, yeah, man, I didn't want to lose the game. I'm going to do whatever this team needs to win games, man. Tonight, it meant 30-some-odd points. Tomorrow, it might mean focusing a little more on defense or rebounding. But usually, it's just getting the ball in the hole. An offensive maestro shouldn't be denied. You know what I'm saying? Mm, mm, mm. They called me the maestro out there. <laughs> I'm loving 2K so far, and I hope you guys are too. Thanks for rocking with me in this video. I'm going to see y'all later. Peace.